what's going on youtube come back at you with another video so this is definitely interesting x-rated has up on his instagram a message after juice world we learned of his tragic death i'm gonna show you he said this may be insensitive but i find it hard to empathize with rich dead drug addicts this generation is celebrating drug abuse like it's cool then want us to mourn when one of them kills themselves I ain't feeling it. He said, our people have never been cool drug addicts. Drugs were placed in our neighborhoods to kill us and minimize our ability to organize for political power. The government literally instituted covert programs to ensure that we abused and were neutralized by drugs after the civil rights movement was a huge success. Hashtag COINTELPRO. We never celebrated dope fiends, our elders and hip hop, always told us not to do these drugs we never celebrated crack addicts alcoholics heroin addicts meth addicts we always portrayed them either as bums or people who had a problem we never celebrated the drug abuse itself drug addicts themselves nor their death from drug abuse do not use hard drugs sip something or smoke some but popping pills using needles and anything with a pipe that ain't weed is out these drug companies are making billions off of the current free advertising that they are getting from rappers who advocate the use of these drugs by name, and our babies are listening to that trash. The FDA is a government agency, and they approve of these products and take billions from the companies who produce these drugs. They don't put any of the money back in our communities or our schools. They use it to build prisons and mortuaries and cemeteries and insurance companies with which they make more money from when we go to jail and die behind drug abuse. When our people were suffering from drug abuse, the government called it a war on drugs, a war on crime, and created programs to punish us. When their people started suffering from drug abuse, they called it a health crisis and created programs to save them. If that don't tell y'all something is wrong, it's because you're too busy getting high to understand. This is a plan. It's working. God bless the dead, but Juice World death ain't about his status or being a legend or rapper. It's about the consequences of our failure to educate our children about this country and its determination to help us minimize and kill ourselves. Y'all under attack and don't even know it. This is so deep to me. Everything that X-Rated said, 100% on point. This is all part of an agenda. This is all part of a plan, and it's fucked up that how how well the plan is working. Just looking back to my own growing up, my own childhood, being a teen in the 90s, and seeing how it was, living through that time, and now looking and seeing what the difference is that these kids are growing up with, and the shit is out of control crazy. Literally, these kids are popping pills, shooting dope. Um, just all the worst shit that you could ever do. And they think this shit is cool. And it's like, what, what happened? How did this mindset change this drastically over just a few generations? Like it, it, it boggles my mind. It just speaks to really how far gone this world really is. Like X-Rated says, this is a plan in my eyes. This shit is a war between good and evil between God and the devil. And right now the devil is running rampant and tearing shit up. And literally everything is just spiraling out of control. Hopefully sooner rather than later, God is able to fix this shit. But that's only, um, you know, that's up to God whenever he decides time is time. But Man, watching this shit happen on a regular basis with these kids, see it on the news every day. You see it. I don't know how many people we lost this year from, you know, the music industry from drugs. But it, this shit is just getting out of control. Let me know what you guys think in the comments, though. I appreciate you watching. Take a second, hit the like, subscribe, share, leave some feedback, ring the notification bell. I appreciate you.